I'm gonna be honest, I don't notice the damage difference. I do not see the damage difference right now. Should I start focusing the smaller bugs now, or should I do it later? Let's start doing it now. I mean, he gains damage every time he splits up, so maybe this isn't a good idea. Surely I should force them not to split up at the start. But then he might enter Berserk mode. Fuck dude, the dilemmas. He gains damage every time he splits up, so surely my my plan here is to not let him split up by by just going for the main boss instead. Surely that's the play then. Let's 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 keep an eye on this then. I should only let him split up if I if I if I have to let him split up. What a tough call to make. Oh, I got the freeze on him too. That's good. Good thing I got freeze on him. That's nice. Okay, so dissociation is really good because it does a flat 30%. It's a flat 30% of the enemy's max health. Always, I think. So maybe I should have gone to Fetris for this. Let's time this correctly. So I don't die a horrible death. Yeah, so he only gains health. He only gains attack if he splits up. So I just ignore everyone else and just go for the main guy. <laughs> I'll just go for the main then. 
There's no reason for me to go for the other ones. I'll just tank. I'll just tank the alts then. I like how my knowledge in previous rounds is helping me. I feel like this is actually helping. I learned from the Clara run that there's conditions for bosses to gain maximum damage. That's useful. But my issue now is that I might enter Berserk mode by accident. I'm gaining ult really quickly though. My ult ga I'm regaining my ult so fucking quickly. But I just don't do damage. I need to ult before I need to press R before he does this thing. So now. Do it now. That ult shouldn't do much damage. In fact it shouldn't do anything. It's a one-man alt, so he's gonna do nothing. Yeah, see, he only gains damage if he splits. So, avoid splitting at all cost. Avoid splitting at all cost. Do not let him split. Please get rid of my debuff. Please get rid of my debuff. Please. Okay, thank you. Okay, I gotta time my R button again. That's enough shield, I think. That's enough shield. Oh, barely. That's barely enough shield. I'm like kind of worried. I don't know. I'm like really worried about the run. I think... I think E4 done hung is the only thing that makes this possible. I think. I don't think I can actually do this without E4. That's what I want to say. Oh, that's good. That's really good timing. Wait, okay. So it doesn't kill. Whoops, I made a mistake there. I can cancel ult if I, if I kill her. If I kill, I, I cancel ult. Uh oh. Oh, this is bad. This is really bad timing. 
I have to ult to live, but I'd lose my R button, which is really bad. That's horrible timing. Okay, so my next solution is to soften one of them up before they ult, so I'd, I'd have to deal with so many high level ultimates. This could be a throw. I could be throwing by doing this. How long do I have? Oh god. I'm screwed. <laughs> Actually, I'm fine. Oh, this is gonna be tough, man. This shouldn't kill me, it's only a level 2 ultimate. Yeah, I'm fine. This, however, might kill me. Maybe. I hope this is enough shields. Oh, that barely is. Fucking hell, man. It's always so close, man. I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this, man. <laughs> so, it gets too close. It gets way too close, man. Yes, the anxiety is killing me, bro. Exactly, man. I hate the anxiety. Oh, now. I should survive this. Barely. Uh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is really bad. Um... I'm screwed. Uh, I don't. I don't see a way out of this. I mean, I can resurrect once, but I kind of don't want to resurrect unless I have to. Ah, oh, that was really unfortunate. If I get rid of one of the big bugs, I feel like my chances increase so much. Which bug is that? Is, is, the, is it the bug going second or is it the bug going first? Second, okay. Level 5 ultimate at this point. Oh, that hurts. That definitely hurts. Forty percent, bro. Forty <laughs> percent. It's close, man. What can I say? I should start probably soften one of them up before the next ultimate hits me. Okay. 
Oh, it's a double ultimate. Shit. Oh no! Wait, this might be fine. I might be fine here. It's only two level two ultimates. I survive one. Alt now. Get most of my sh- I get a bit of my shields back. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, bro. I survived that. Holy shit, I made a right call there. This is so fucking tough, bro. This is such a tough run. Why? Why am I doing this? Oh my god, I'm low. When did this happen? I can break one of the bugs in case he ults. I have R for the other one. The second one, right? The second one will ult me. I almost mistimed that. I'm gonna be honest. I almost fucking threw the run. I can break this one so it doesn't ult me. I get an action forward. Come on. Come on. One down? So now I just need to focus on weakness breaking this one. I mean, things can still go badly. That's the worst part. Things can still go really badly. I weakness break this one. Maybe I shouldn't have done that yet. Maybe I should have waited for something. I get debuffed. That's kind of bad, but... I'm no longer debuffed. Okay, ult. Uh, I can kill the bugs if I have to, to weaken his ultimate. When is it? Okay, his ult comes in there. Okay. So I press R just before it. This should kill some of the bugs and also give me shield. So his ultimate shouldn't do much damage here. I break him here. I apply dissociation to them. The the freeze damage should kill. The freeze damage should definitely kill that. I have my R coming up soon. He explodes. He explodes. You explode. I press R. Let's go! <laughs> Oh my god, I actually did it. That was a That was pretty that was pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, that was a really stressful run. 
That was a fucking stressful run. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was tough. <laughs>